hi guys welcome back to my channel i'm back with another video today's video is completely different i just woke up it is 5 a.m now and everyone is still asleep so i'm actually going for a run which is actually really really crazy for me to even say that so i started running like three months ago yeah and today i'm going to try attempt my first 1k uh 10k i've never run a 10k before so it's going to be really really interesting i am just busy in the kitchen now making my energy drink for my run i actually started by walking because i was on a weight loss journey and then by then i had lost like um 10 kgs i wanted to tone and also wanted a challenge and i thought running would be, <laughs> be interesting so the energy drink i'm using today is called q hush it's my husband's one it's actually like a gaming supplement i've never tried this one before but i've tried the one he used before which was g fuel it was amazing the energy lasts forever so i'm gonna try this one today i'm gonna down this now So I'll be taking my running vest, which looks like this. This is the Inoxon running vest. I got it from I think Amazon. Yeah, this. Put this on. Huh. And then here I'm gonna put my phone that I'm filming with it, and I have a little water bottle. And this is a 215 now. Just put it here. I'm also taking one gel. These are the ones that I use, the Vuma Energy ones, and these are the chocolate, I think. Yeah, chocolate flavor. And these are the only ones with caffeine. They're my favorite. They're really, really sweet. I love that they're big as well. So they're bigger than the goose. And they're like 10 rand cheaper than the goose. And they taste better than the goose. I don't know. That's just me. But it's big enough for me to... for It's big enough to last a 10 On During the week, I do 3Ks for 5 days. Monday, Friday. And then Saturday, I do a 5K at Park Run. So I normally take this on Saturdays. And I don't even finish it because it's so big. So today I'm going to take maybe half of it at in the beginning and then half at 5k. We'll see. So I'm going to put it here with my water. And then here I'm going to put my phone. And I also have my little uh, headphones thing. I like to put this at the back because I don't really need to use it. Here at the back there's a big pocket there. I didn't get the bladder thing because that's kind of like wild for me. It's it's too advanced for me. I just wanted something that I can like carry simple things and not like run with things in my hands. And also like during the week, I run with the dogs. I like to put like their treats and stuff. So this is perfect for me. And this is from Shein, I think. The shorts are mm, pick and pay clothing, I think. And now I am starting my first kilometer. I'm thinking I'm just gonna quickly go out of the gate and do maybe like a round lap around the community and then maybe come back and see what I can finish inside. So I'm gonna do that because I know outside there's a lot of runners, so it will be safe. So we're going uphill now. My pace is at 11.31. So I'll catch up with you guys a little bit later. So I just got out of the gates, but I have to run this whole road up there. 
up to like those trees up there and then there's a turn to go around the block so that's what i'm gonna do i don't even know how long this is but there we go like my hands are tingling like crazy <laughs> we're gonna work it out so i just passed my 5k and time wise i'm at 38 minutes and 30 seconds which is better than my last 5k pr i think it was 40 40 minutes and 40 seconds so i'm i'm very impressed with this i'm like five minutes down my pr so i'm gonna continue and i'm gonna have my second half of the gel and some water so i am coming back at the gates so this is kind of like where i started when i left the gates so i went up this road and then all the way around and then around the whole area and now i'm back here and that gave me seven kilometers so i'm gonna go in and finish the last three kilometers inside and time wise i am at 56 minutes so i'm still finishing my three kilometers inside i'm just walking up the hill but it's so hard inside here it's like less motivating or else outside because there's lots of runners and long roads there's there's more motivation there here i'm just alone i haven't even seen one runner outside i met a lot there was even a running club that was going on but inside it's so quiet so i just got back home i finished my 10k in an hour and 20 minutes the last kilometer was the hardest because my guy started chafing really really bad and i didn't glide them in the morning so and my quick whip is drenched in sweat and i'm gonna go and shower thank you guys for sticking around and i will see you guys next time bye